Ah, baby Tigre. Okay. If we want these cranky old guerrillas to help Libertad, we need Lucky and Lorenzo on board. So here's what we're going to do. Ever since Anton got obsessed with the cancer drugs and making Viviro, finding medical supplies for Lucky's clinic has been impossible. So I bribed a pilot to fly some in. When the supplies arrive, we tell Lucky they're a gift from Libertad, and boom, everybody's friends. Perfect plan, right? Well, it would have been if some hijo de puta didn't shoot down my chopper. Go get those supplies before someone else does, baby tigre. Remember the three guerrilla principles. All of us. Baby Tigre, how's it going with those medical supplies? I'm working on it. Don't put off what you can do today, because tomorrow can turn into yesterday, and by then it's too late. I think you might need a nap, big guy. Clara, guess who just found where all the coffee is made in Yara? It's not a joke, Danny. This is where the army forces farmers to give up their harvests or get thrown into the camps. Castillo grows rich from the profits and the people starve. You want to stop it? Take the oil powering the factory. And while you're at it, take the fucking factory too. This looks like they drop. What a mess. This is too easy. Que vola! Who are you? We're La Moral, and the Leste is our land. Our land, our medicine. You practice that little speech? Yeah. This is property of Libertad. Ah, Libertad. Knew you would come begging for our help. We should be fighting Castillo together. I'm Honron, second in command. Nice bro. Name's Danny. Danny Rojas. Uh-huh. Company! Over there! By the chopper! Batter up!
finish them off! Truck! Talent level done, but Yelena needs these supplies. We got wounded. Yelena's your boss? Yeah. She's gonna kick my ass if I don't come back with something. Well, Clara's gonna try to kick mine if I don't bring this to the Legends. Libertad wants the Legends of 67? <laughs> half of Yara things are dead. Oh, they're very alive. And half of La Moral things are full of shit. But I majored in history. They paid him blood to put Anton's papa in his grave. Tell you what. You give me these supplies, I'll introduce you. Ah, coño. Yelena's gonna kill me. But at least I got to meet the legends first. Now, Danny, you get us a chopper? Then we can talk supplies. Welcome to La Moral. Liberta. Whatever. Ten euros a day. One of our soldiers. Danny, right? Two. You need a chopper? Well, you won't get any money. The famous young king once said. The tree of liberty must be refreshed from time to time with the blood of patriots. That is a lie. The only blood I want. Here's your wheels. Got here as fast as I could. Gracias, gracias.
Entendido. Adiós, reinforcements. ¿Qué Aquí. I'll keep this. Libertad could have used that oil. Oh, shit! Anything worth my time in Bariga? Ah, see. Si. The people there are nice. At least they were the last time I was there. When was that?
Just make sure you're not underneath when I shoot it down. The supply. <gasps> Palapinga! El Tigre! Feast of the Revolution! You gotta sign my pants. Como se llama, señorita? Honron. Eh. I'm with La Moral. Uh, La Moral? Terroristas. Honron, this is Lore. I know who he is. I think the word he's looking for is guerrilla. You're not guerrillas. You're a street gang. At least we're not hiding on the mountain while the world goes to shit. Have you seen what's going on down there? Go, check out a Biovida facility. I dare you. The legends don't take orders from anarchists. Entiende? Enough, Lorenzo. <gasps> no, you know what? Fuck you. La Moral is keeping these supplies. This is our revolution, not yours. A farmer got caught in the crossfire today. Took a bullet in the stomach. Without this, he won't make it to tomorrow. Lucky mama. A lot of the bullets I pull are from La Moral. There is a difference between playing with guns and fighting La Revolution. El Tigre. Sí. They're big on lectures. If these abuelos want to live in the museum, whatever. I can't importa. Or maybe I borrow some souvenirs. Talk to me when you got a minute. There's my baby Tiggy. Those medical supplies will put a lot of guerrillas back together. Gracias. Lucky appreciates them too. Even if she doesn't show it. And bringing La Morale was smart. This camp needs young blood. Shakes things up. Now we need to work on Lorenzo. Half the abuelos out there hang on his every word. Honron said Lorenzo should visit a BioVira facility. But getting Lorenzo to do anything is like pulling a tank through the mud, sideways. I'm going to give him a little reminder of what we stood for. And you are going to bring the BioVita to him. All you got to do is tiptoe in, take photographs of anything suspicious, and get out. For a so-called research facility, they have way more guns than lab coats down there. They're hiding something, baby Tigre. And we're going to slap Lorenzo in the face with whatever it is. You mean Hope you have good camera skills. What do you keep?
those guerrillas could use some support. an eye out for her. Gracias. I'm worried something terrible has happened. Better watch my step. Engine. Doing to all the outcasts. in the water. Need to take a picture for Lorenzo. I think I'm going to be sick. Castillo, you fucking monster. I need more pics. Cut 
Sounds came from in there. I've got a bad feeling about this place. Yara will only shine when it is united under one philosophy. And all this bullshit about trading guns. What are they doing? Fuck! It's sealed off. I can't get in. This should be enough to convince Lorenzo. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Horon was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. This is what Libertad and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste? That's the end. You shoot the tree. It feels different. What feels different? This camp. I don't know. We need to talk. To think I looked up to these ancianos. Don't waste your time. We're freeing El Este with or without them. You need to talk to my boss, Yelena. And you need to see our operation up close. Swing by El Agujero is La Moral's badass headquarters in Concepcion. Say this password to our doorman. Muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. I'll tell Yelena you're on your way. Attention, whoever you are. You are trespassing in illegal airspace. Turn around now or we will fire upon you. God damn it!
What can I do? You should talk to Signora Toga and see what she needs. She's the president of the farmers' collectives there. I'm on it. She's just too libertad that her farmers are about to break our agreement. We really need these people on our side, Danny. Getting close, I think. So you know, Gilena's the big boss. I'm team captain, and you won't be able to miss Gilberto. Why? Who's Gilberto? Only the most fabulous spy in Oloviara. You can't even fart in El Este without Gilberto's network hearing about it. Spies and hackers. La Moral sounds like the real deal. You don't fuck around. And if you've never been to Concepcion before, the place has got a curfew. When the sun goes down, Soldados come out. Thanks for the heads up. Coño, I got a helicopter on my ass. Call me when you get there. I'm at Concepcion. How do I find La Moral? I'll send you a pic. Show no one. What are you sending me? It will help you find the door. Don't forget the password and remember, curfew. Hey there. Stay strong. Muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. Welcome to El Agujero. Try anything, and I'll cut your head off and use it as a football. Nice to meet you too. My name's Danny. Alfredo. Down the stairs. I need six volunteers. I'll talk to my people, honey. B. Jorge and Anna's gangs are probably on the ship. You're Yelena? Mierda! Danny, right? Where's my medicine? You mean Libertas meds? I gave them to the legends. No. You handed it to some retirees shitting their diapers on top of a mountain. What could you possibly want from them? We need more than bullets and guerrillas to take down Castillo. Like it or not, Yaranos love the legends. Clara Garcia loves her politics. Good luck getting those abuelos off their asses. We could use La Morale's help. You know why Clara never told you about us? Because to her, we're just a bunch of kids playing with guns. She loves to talk about the future. But it's her future, not ours. Clara's just a Castillo who lost his dick. So you have a better plan for Yara? Bullets first, politics later. You said you needed volunteers. Admiral Benitez got the jump on us a couple of hours ago. She's holding my people hostage on a cargo ship. I'll go. Alone? I don't get it. Consider us even for the meds. Save my people and I'll think about it. Mm-hmm. Hey, for real? Libertad? No shit. You saving our people, right? That's the plan. I know a farmer with a helicopter who can fly you out to the ship. Follow me. Take all the rasol. Be nice to him. Come on. That's a good horse. Whoa, now. You're with Libertad? I am. I think it would be great if we joined forces. Yeah? We've been fighting and we've been winning. But Admiral Benitez will always have more than we do. We kill one soldado today. Tomorrow, they get replaced with three more. And when La Moral people die, there is no one replacing them. Nadie. On top of that, 
Where are you going? So, yeah. Nadie. On top of that, the farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. We need fresh blood. Real fighters. What about getting the legends to join? We try. None of those abuelos want to fight. I heard a lot of them even support Castillo. <laughs> you heard wrong. Well, I don't see any abuelos fighting now. I'm working on it. So, how do these farmers get a helicopter? They built it from the parts of ones we shot down. Inga. These farmers are 100% on our side. The other farmers are not? What's going on? Dick, I wasn't done. The other farmers are not? Some are. Some are with Castillo. You think we can get them on our side? We're gonna need them. Only when we're going to liberate El Este. Maybe when they hear Libertad is fighting with us, they'll join. Your good propaganda, Danny. I probably don't have time to check everything. Are you going to save those people? Yelena called. Do you want to lift to that boat? Let's do this. Get in. Danny, I'm going to be careful and stay low. I'll get you as close as I can. But where did you learn how to fly? I did my basic service as a pilot a couple of years ago. I got kicked out for calling the captain a cove mierda. <laughs> I was kicked out of the ground forces. Turns out drill sergeants don't like getting punched in the throat. Good to know. I never seen you before. When did you join La Moral? <laughs> Wait! I was told you were with La Moral! I'm doing this rescue as a favor. I'm with Libertad. What can you tell me about La Moral? You know that village? They call it Maldito. That the real name? Yeah. Some Spaniard named it back in 1490, whatever. Couple months ago, Admiral Benitez decided to make it illegal to go to the water and fish. The people protested. Benitez executed half the town. So what does La Moral do? They tracked and killed every last soldado who did the executing. And I'm not talking about guerrilla ambush jungle shit. I'm talking about following them to their homes and slitting their throats while their families asleep. Assassin shit. These kids are smart, coordinated, and cold-blooded. Sounds like it. Shop pass. We keep tabs on military convoys passing through there and report them to La Moral. Seems like they run a tight operation. These kids are on the ball. Yelena is more organized than the military. La Moral's got our back. When Admiral Panita started getting rough with our families, La Moral got rough back. Killed any soldado who dared to step foot on our lands. Pretty soon, they stopped coming. any closer. This is great. Gracias, mi amigo. Good luck saving those people. I am not being paid enough for this detail. Oh, 
Only two more hours, then home. You're the toughest guerrilla. <laughs> Spread out. It can't be far. They were right there. They have our people tied up near the front of the boat. Some of our fighters in a container over the hole. Some of our fighters yeah. in a container over the hole. Save them. Some of our fighters in a container over the hole. Save them. There's people in here. Help us. On the ship. I freed as many as I could. Hang tight. I am sending boats and backup. Gracias. This is Admiral Benitez. To the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. Look out! 
At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons and taking one last look at a nation that does not want you. Instead of peacefully serving Yara as outcasts, you will die. Right here. Right now. Yelena. Been waiting for you to clear the air. Can somebody tell those planes to hold still? Uh, really? Fuck yeah! Elena, it's done. Your people are safe. I heard. We even for the supplies? Fuck yeah. Need me for anything else? Come back to El Aguero. Shit is getting real. We need to rally our people and talk next steps. Dale. Coño. 
feel like bad shit's gone down here. Yelena, is done. Your people are safe. We even for the supplies? Fuck yeah. Need me for anything else? Come back to El Aguero. Shit is getting real. We need to rally our people and talk next steps. Dale, 